The name of the game was defense. Watch Detroit linebacker Mike Lucci, number 53, pour in from the left as he executes a classic blitz. He then repeated the act. The Detroit Lions and the Minnesota Vikings engaged in a fierce struggle that limited both offenses to under 200 total yards. Detroit finally began moving late in the first quarter behind the running of one of their prize rookies, Mel Farr. Farr can do it all, and in this game, highlighted by unyielding defense, his 90 yards in total offense was remarkable. Tom Nowatzki then doubled 15 yards closer to the game's first score. But the Viking defense gathered themselves as linebacker Lonnie Warwick intercepted Carl Sweetan's pass and returned it to midfield. Fullback Bill Brown then got loose for 29 yards, which was the longest run of the day. But as the first quarter ended, so did the Vikings drive. On second down, Red Phillips juggled a catch out of bounds. And at the start of the second quarter, Detroit's defensive back, Lim Barney, number 20, took over. In the span of one quarter, Barney intercepted three passes. With a fine block from Bruce Maher, the first interception turned into the game's first score. Playing defensive back is considered the most difficult and crucial position in football. It's unusual that a rookie ever gets to play there, but it's almost impossible that a rookie finishes the season tied for the lead in total interception. Lim Barney did just that and is truly remarkable. His third interception of the quarter and 10th of the season set up the Lions for their last touchdown. Barr dashed seven yards closer, but the drive was temporarily halted by Minnesota's Allen Page, number 88, at the far right of the screen. Page is another rookie. At the end of the first half, Carl Sweetan flipped to Tommy Watkins as the score now stood at 14 to nothing, Lions. Neither team scored a touchdown in the second half, but the Vikings dominated the action, which took place in between the 20-yard lines. Minnesota's only legitimate drive was launched by Viking newcomer Brady Keyes, number 24. The return was ended abruptly at the 30-yard line. Dave Osborne finished as the NFL's second leading rusher, ahead of Gail Sayers and Johnny Rowland. Ron Vanderkellen, number 15, kept the drive alive as he ran for a first down. But that was as far as the drive got. On first down, Lim Barney waited anxiously for his fourth interception of the game. He would just have to settle for three. 
On second down, Vander Kellen spotted Phillips open at the goal line, but it wasn't their day. On third down, watch Detroit's linebacker, number 58, Paul Newmark, wait nervously before a blitz. Flipped over, he still got the passer. And this is why on fourth down late in the game, Fred Cox settled for a field goal that gave Detroit a rookie-dominated 14-3 win.